A bipartisan group of senators have unveiled a $118 billion package, but the House is already voicing disapproval. The majority of the funding, $60 billion, would go to Ukraine, $14 billion for Israel, and $10 billion in humanitarian aid, including for people in Gaza and the West Bank. The bill also includes approximately $20 billion for border security policies. The bill calls for a mandated border shutdown should the daily average of migrant crossings reach 5,000. The bill also ends the practice known as catch and release, where migrants caught crossing the border illegally are released into the U.S. while they wait for their asylum application to be processed. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer says the Senate will begin the process of moving forward with the legislation this week, but the bill is already facing opposition. House Speaker Mike Johnson says the bill is worse than expected, adding if the bill reaches the House, it will be dead on arrival.